Japan is a nation in mourning after the assassination of its former leader Shinzo Abe on Friday. But for its governing Liberal Democratic Party, a glimmer of good news after Sunday's upper house elections. The LDP has been the dominant party since the end of the Second World War and had a high approval rating going into the vote. Abe was a member of the lower house and still wielded considerable influence as head of the LDP's largest faction. Analysts say the results will help Prime Minister Kishida consolidate power. You know, the biggest threat to his position has been Shinzo Abe. So uh, the fact that Abe was killed a couple of days ago actually uh, is another thing that may stabilize his regime in, in a strange way. The strong election showing will give him a chance to increase military spending. Revising Japan's pacifist constitution, one of Abe's unfulfilled ambitions, is also likely to be on the cards. Although analysts say amending the constitution will not be an easy process. It is still unclear how to amend the constitution and which parts of it need to be amended. Even amongst those in support of constitution amendment, opinions vary a lot. There can't be a quick change of the constitution. Even any bloc getting two-thirds of the seats can't do it. The Japanese people will vote on it, and it is hard to pass. Meanwhile, the suspect in Abe's assassination has been handed over to prosecutors in Nara, where he will likely be detained and questioned before being charged. Police have acknowledged there were security flaws in Friday's attack and have promised a thorough investigation. Florence Louis, Al Jazeera.